Yeah, bring that with you today. Just in case. Bro, this power. I don't know why my sinus is blown up last night. All right, here we are. We got the sandwiches made. It's time to go catch a $50,000 fish at Lake Palestine. Somebody comment below, let me know. Lake Palestine or Palestine, I don't know. But somebody's about to win 50K in the next eight, nine, 10 hours on one bite. I'm about to go chuck a frog around. I'm about to go flip me a bandito bug. I'm about to go swim my jig. I'm about to go try to catch a big one. And make this championship cut. So you kind of get like, eh, eh. it's like either a championship cut and a fifty thousand dollar fish, or you gotta pick one. So like, if you ain't in contention to make a championship cut, you might want well to be chunking up something big, like trying to catch a big one. And that ain't gotta be no eight inch swim bait. That, I mean, you can just go to a zone where you think biggins live. You know what I mean? So, will you do we me had, a favor though? What? If you win 50K today, what? will you pay to turn on this dang power? Let me tell y'all what's weird, okay? So this big storm blew through last night, right? But y'all just pay attention next time a storm comes through. Every time a storm comes through, the power goes out before it even hits. Before the, the storm even gets here. So is it the wind that messes up? power you know power lines they might come down a tree limb may come hit it and bust it off you know it was it during the storm it's literally like i see the storm way away it's like click gone i don't know what it was my note humidity we ain't got no air in this house i didn't have my sound maker on I had the window open last night and his neighbor shot across the street over here. There's out there a flashlight shining around. I thought somebody was breaking in my damn boat. And I, I got up, you know, me and my damn boss were walking over. And I'm like, somebody's in my boat. I ease over there and I look out the window. It's dark, can't see nothing. It's the neighbors outside shining the lights around their house. Like, where's the breaker box? Where's the breakers? The power's out. You can't use the breaker. Why are you waking me up at four o'clock in the morning? I got the window up so I can breathe. Well, let's go catch bass. The breaker, the breaker's on. Ooh. Oh, it's chopping, son. I mean, straight chopping. I got Rick again. No. Look at him smiling. Who do I got? Ding dong. Let's go. <laughs> Ding dong. Oh, Cody, when are we getting back, man? I don't know, dude. You can we gotta get back. I guess I gotta step up my game to get back. <laughs> What up, what up with bro. you? No, we do not. Have a hey, I miss you, man. Listen, these camera guys, Major League hey, Fishing. Guys, I'm a big fan. Can I get they you on? Badasses. Yes, sir. Let me hop out. I just gotta dig out a couple of baits. But some people can't get here because their trees and that are down. Oh, really? Yeah, to the trailers. Wow. Is he moving forward? No. Oh, are we going? Yeah, we're going. We're rolling. We gotta go. All right, here we are at the boat ramp at Kickapoo. <clears throat> Y'all see this jig right here? Chewed. It's been chewed. My cracking crawl is chewed. I don't know whether I need a new jig or not. I kind of want a new jig. Make it roll. Buy a few boats here. How many boats we got? Eight? Nine? Eleven. There's eleven boats here? Eleven out of eighteen? No, sixteen. 16. So there's five other boats in here. That's right. what I counted. Yeah, we might have done. 
call it audible. Yeah. I had to call it audible. In beginning of period one, we're fish till 10 30. It's chopping the wind, chopping. gonna talk about it let's go let's go she didn't want the frog so i put her on that swimming jig baby let's see what's let's go dustin you're the first angler on score tracker two pounds three ounces Score tracker Jordan Lee's now in first place, one fish, three pounds, ten ounces. Ish Monroe now on score tracker, he's in second place, one fish, three pounds, three ounces. Five anchors on score tracker. Justin, Justin Lucas just caught his second fish weighing three pounds, seven ounces. He's now in first place, two fish, five pounds, ten ounces. He needs three pounds, seven ounces. Time. 
three pounds, seven ounces. Yep. Justin, that fish gives you five pounds, 10 ounces. You're tied for first place with Justin Lucas. Third place is Jordan Lee, three pounds, 10 ounces. Still just eight anglers on score tracker. We have an hour and 42 minutes left in the first period. ounces you are tied for second with Dustin or with Justin Lucas at five pounds ten ounces Fletcher Shryock I just caught his second fish moving him to four with four pounds eleven ounces Got me one, boys. Boom! That's a five pounder. Five, five, five pound, thirteen ounces. Five, thirteen. What's the big fish? I don't know yet. That's a look. Look five, at that. 13. Five, thirteen, baby. Boom, boom, son. That's what I'm talking about. Oh gosh, thank you, fish. I don't know. That fish might be worth fifty thousand dollars today. I don't even know what. Look at that. Bob, got him. I just Dustin, that fish gives you 11 pounds, 7 ounces. You're in first place. You have an 11 pounds, 7 ounce lead over ninth place. There are 8 anglers on score tracker. I'll tell you why I'm losing so bad. It's so up close and personal. Is that Lucas right over there? What did you say? Oh, I said, no, nah. I said, I'm going to tell you why I lose them so bad. Yeah, why? It's so up close and personal. Like, it's so right there, and I don't have time to set the hook, and when oh. I do, they're hot right at the boat, and they come off. Five, four, three, two, one. Lines out. End of period one. All right. End of period one. I love losing them. <laughs> oh, I lost one about four, lost one about three. Had two more, three, three and a half pound bites. It's just part of bass fishing. Can't let it, can't let it affect your day. You know, we still got two periods left. And, uh, you know, it's just one of them deals that happens. But I would have loved to have that. I'd have had 20 pounds by now. So, but I think if I can catch 10 pounds a period, the next, I, mean, I think 30 pounds is the number we're looking for. So, I don't know, we'll see. I, I do know later in the day, if it we get a good storm come through, they're gonna slide back up there really good. So, I feel good about it. Y'all better not catch a 514. Them boys better not. That's 50 Gs. Thanks, fish. Pretty one. I don't know if it'll last, but... No, you can't think it's going to last. You know, no. Keep fishing like you want to get a clear one. You going to stay in here for a while? Yeah, I'm going to stay out here. I'm going to hit that island. 
Really? That's, that's two to go past us. I don't think we'll go get any more. Oh, that is so sweet. Man, I kind of wish we could get it. Yeah, but I don't think we're going to. There's two sides to it. I kind of wish we'd get it, but I kind of wish not because that means they'd be biting really good and somebody has an opportunity to catch a dag on the big <laughs> Group B's are killing me. I'm telling you. I have four group B's in a row. One minute. Four group B's in a row. Alright, here we go. I've rigged up a bandito. I'm gonna slow way down. Pitch real methodical. I ain't saying a big one won't come out on a swim jig because he still will. Five, four, three, two, one. Lines in. All right. You're getting a period two. The goal of this period is to put in the boat. caught the first fish of the second period. It weighed six pounds, 10 ounces. He's now in first place with 14 pounds, 12 ounces. Jordan Lee just caught a two pound, seven ounce fish. Moved him to fifth place. First place is Alton Jones Jr., 19 pounds, 7 ounces. Second is Ish Monroe, 12 pounds, 12 pounds, 4 ounces. Dustin, your third, 11 pounds, 7 ounces. Any your thoughts on that big fish? Oh, out and caught. Yeah. I don't think I have any thoughts on it. <laughs> I knew that one. Justin Lucas just caught a four pound, 12 ounce bass, moving him to third, dropping you to six. Yes. You're still four pound, six ounces ahead of Russ Lane and Knight. Hang on a second. No, I'm not saying that. You've got to go off again. Let your anger know that we are expecting severe thunderstorm to move through the area within the next hour. 60 mile an hour wind gusts or possible quarter inch hail are possible. Wow. No reply needed, but keep your phone close. Wow. Dustin, we've got another little Changing the lead on score tracker. Alton Jones Jr. has moved to first place 
his last fish weighed eight pounds, three ounces. Dang, boy. That's old big fish wizard today. He locked that 50K up. Sure. He's got five fish that weigh 27 pounds, 10 ounces. Big bag. That one we're picking up back last. Back last. What's he doing? Uh, what's Four he, minutes. What's he doing? Yeah. What's uh, Junior doing? I would probably say too cloudy to really decide. Yeah, he probably chatter baiting reeds or something. I don't know. So maybe I should go back in there. I don't know. I need to expand. Bad idea. Zero bass. Three minutes. All anglers can move during the break and find cover. Period two will not start until the weather threat passes. delay weather delay Mike. Oh, ow, come on hey, over. Over get over here buddy get in here get on hey go on oh, this popping <laughs> ah. all right that Woo. Mm. 10 pounds brother 10 pounds I think I can do it. I just, hell, I don't know if I can get any bites back in there where I've been catching mine. I mean, I'm, I'm caught in between going out there on that buck brush and going in there, but I don't need a ton of weight. Hell, I'm up by two pounds right now, you know? I think we're gonna go back in there for an hour. And then if I ain't caught nothing in those two stretches, I'm gonna idle my way back out, spend the last hour out there on that, on that boat, bro. That's the only thing you can do. Any updates? No, we hear my phone go off if it does. Well, if you're caught, if you wanna head back over to where you were and just hang out there, you can do that. Yeah, let's go and do that since it's clear.
fish caught after the weather delay was by Russ Lane. It weighed four pounds four ounces. You're now in ninth. You need one pound ten ounces. That fish it moves you back into eighth place with 14 pounds two ounces. You're ahead of ninth place rest lane by one pound one ounce. Yes. Dustin, while we were making that idle, rest lane caught a three pound three ounce bass. He's now in seventh place. Yourself and actually I guess Jordan Lee's in eighth. 14 pounds, two ounces. You're in ninth, 14 pounds, two ounces. He has five fish, you have four. just caught a three pound four ounce pass increasing his lead over eighth place oh Ninth place, Jordan Lee is two pounds six ounces. There is 50 minutes and 37 seconds left in the knockout round. Thirty-five minutes. violation oh, penalty. Oh. oh what I'm talking about son I done got fired up oh <laughs> I'm talking about a late day firework for you oh son she come out of there and choked it look at that oh, God. that's six six 
Found zero ounces. That's six. Ooh. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Freaking giant, man. Middle of the day. Oh, I have worked so hard. And I finally got one in big spot. Middle of the day. <laughs> yes. Look at that. Thank you, girl. Oh, thank you so much for biking. Ding. 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 you're a penalty. Oh, I am in penalty. I gotta sit down and think about it. <laughs> I gotta sit down and talk about it. Think about it. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Look, man, you get out here and you grind all day. Come down the stretch. I said that earlier this morning. I said later in the day they might fire up over here, but I didn't expect to catch a six pounder. So, oh mate, that's huge. That's a big, big deal. So, I really just want to come back out here and have a chance at a hundred gram fish because I, I really think I can catch him right now. I'm out of breath. <laughs> Bass fishing never got you out of breath. There you go. <laughs> with that six pounder leaves you in eighth place but your lead over ninth place jordan lee is now six pounds five ounces that ain't enough that ain't enough <sighs> five four three two one and the penalty oh, perfect 30 seconds no changes. Five, four, three, two, one. Lines out. End of knockout round. Late day six pounder. I wouldn't have called it. It had been real close, five ounces. So, God, man, that's awesome. To grind all day long and then slide in this cut like that. If I if I would have went back in there and made that other decision, I wouldn't have made it 100. percent I maybe had caught one more fish, you know. So and then Jordan caught that other one over here. So, but uh, championship round bound. Ooh, that's three in a row. Uh, man, that's awesome. Got a chance tomorrow for a hundred grand to win the tournament hundred grand for one bass and I don't know fingers crossed she might come right down through there because there's some big ones through there I mean I had a five and a six and a couple fours so I don't know I'm decided to go back fishing have an opportunity that's all you can ask for so uh, got it done looking forward to it it's gonna be a it's gonna be a shootout lots of scales <laughs> I'm telling you, it's going to go down. <laughs> Congratulations, brother. Hey, I need a big hug. <laughs> Let me get a big hug. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, let's, do a, let's do a... What was the lure today? What was the thing that won it? So I just, uh, oh, my gosh. Talk about... You caught me off guard when you hooked that big mother. Then you dance back there like you usually do. I should have slid up here, but... Ooh, it all came together. That was a big one. Ah. Uh. 
six pound. Well, we made it. We made it. Championship round tomorrow um, on Palestine. Heavy hitters, one bite, a hundred thousand dollars, and if you win the tournament, another hundred grand. So we got an opportunity at two hundred thousand dollars tomorrow. Bass fishing, unbelievable. You know, I'm gonna get back out there again tomorrow and do the same thing. I've got one good little stretch and then I'm gonna have to expand, you know, I'll have to move around. But the key thing about tomorrow is it's a three pound minimum, okay? They gotta be three pounders to even keep. So if you catch a 214, which is a good fish, it doesn't, you gotta let him go. It does not count. So we're fishing for big ones tomorrow. I can't wait. Championship round, the last three derbs, we've been in it. I think we're due for another one. Y'all stay tuned. Like, subscribe, we'll see you.